Um, this is a Claim Designs technology and today I, I bring you another new video based on how to send uh, bulk mails with a Grammadin mailer. So these are contacts you want to reach us. This is our company name. This is our website. Um, this is uh, my email. If you want to reach me on email, then if you want to call, call me on this number. Call on WhatsApp on this number. So let's get started. So you first of all have to get your Gamadin layer and uh, mailer extracted to your desktop. This is how it looks when you extract it to your desktop. Then you have to open this that says a GM. From this GM, you can click on it. So when you click on it, you have to open here. You understand? So let's let let let's start afresh. So let's say I want to open it. I will double click on that GM. Then here is asking you to create a project. You have to create uh, your project to create your project what you're gonna do is uh, click on create new project and then to set up your project what you're gonna do is to click on manual setup from the manual setup then there's gonna ask you you first of all start by adding your emails the the email of the sender and uh, the email your clients are going to reply to as they receive your message so clicking on this header you get this panel here and let's say you want to add an email of the sender i can do this like this you understand i will put the the name the name of uh, the that is uh, the name of my company first of all in claim design stack claim design stack then I will add in the email that I want to use in there so let's say I will remove this add a new email there So this is the email that I'm going to use there. Then the email to reply to, I can as well use this email that I have here. I will copy the email, then add it here. Then the subject of the message, let's say I want to send a message, I say, opportunity, sorry. Opportunity, opportunity to own to own sorry to own a prof professional. websites a business website so that's the email that I want to send the opportunity to own a business website so that is all about the header you first of all add in the the, the name that is uh, the name you want to use that is the name of the sender then you're going to add your email here just the way it is like this you add it there then the reply to email you add it there then the subject of the message you add it there then the next thing you're going to do is uh, click on the test body you're going to send your text if you want to import your text you can click on this uh, a standard test body then you can browse and select the text if you already have it maybe on your 
there type it on your notepad in a text format you can select it but if you want to type in your text then you can click on this uh, internal text body then you can grab your text that you want to send let's say this is the text i want to send i can easily copy the text then here i'll paste in the text there's a text that i want to send so i can you know make it a look more cashy by separating the text you understand so this is how i want it to be then here the next thing i'm gonna do is um, after adding my text the, th the next thing i'm gonna do is uh, add my recipients that's the emails that i want to send then i can click on recipients if i want to browse it from file i can just click on this that says uh, recipient from file look at it here i'll click on it then i can browse browse the recipients but if i want just to type it maybe i already have it type i can just click on this one that's the recipient list i can just paste in the recipients that i want to send that's the email just copy the emails and paste it here but if you want to import it you just click on this that's the recipient files you click on browse let's say i want to have my own here these are the emails that i want to send it to so i'm using my email so that i can be able to log in to see whether it delivers rightfully so i'm going to select my emails then i'll click on open the next thing i'm gonna do is uh, i'm going to set up my SNTP server to set up my SNTP server what i'm gonna do here is to click on SMTP. look at SNTP here got it here then from the SNTP i'm going to use uh, my gmail SNTP. then i will just type in smtp.gmail.com then here the port the server port is going to be is the SMTP server port i'm going to use um, 465 for the SMTP server port then my email i will use it here I type in my email address there then i'll enter the password of my email address so i already entered it before then if you are using a, a self-hosted SNTP or you maybe you bought an SNTP from another server, you can enter your SNTP server name here. Then you enter the port of that SNTP server you bought. Then you can enter the username here, then the password. And after that, you have to text your SNTP server to see whether it connects or not. So what I'm gonna do now is to click on text. I will say yes. Then it's not texting the SMTP server for me to know whether it's working or not. So let's just wait in a moment. You see, it works successfully. You see, text, you understand. So it's okay. The result is okay, meaning that it connects. So I will have to click close this. Then the next thing I'm going to do is uh, trying to work on my delivery. See, delivery, I mean to send it you understand so i can work on this then it's also the same thing that we did when you click on this uh, configure they will also take you to that SNTP and uh, side so what i'm gonna do look at the stop here that say look at this that says sense you understand when i click on this sense i'm going to uncheck some things here so i'm gonna check uncheck this uh, text domain send that domain i'll remove it they say take smtp before sending we already tested it then i can remove it but if you want to leave it you want to st test it again to be sure you can check it but i will remove it because i already tested it or i will leave it then i will uncheck these ones this uh, text there dkin i won't check all these you say okay save project before sending or maybe save a project uh, after sending so i'll have to make sure that uh, i will save the project after sending you understand so is there the preview limits i'll leave it at 1000 here then the thread 
I can leave it for then is a send mode I can leave it normal then it's, that is what I'm gonna do then it says look at this button down here that says send message look at the button down here it says send message so click on it then it start testing the SNTP server for you see is okay so the text was successful then the next thing I'm gonna do now is to click on this one that says send message so I can click on the send message you see it's already send a message to those numbers that I those emails that I selected so that's it so let's see it's now you see now it's sending the messages successfully anyone that does not send it also tell you so they say 12 because I send it to 12 numbers 12 uh, email addresses so that is what I have here is a 12 messages sent successfully you say uh no failures you understand so everything went on successfully it's a started time and the completed time so the uh analysis is there so i can just click on okay you see that it say send completed so you see yeah the the statistics here you understand they say success success is 12 that is 100 percent so it went 100 percent sure you say rejected none then fail none so you click on OK. Then I can check those email down to see whether they really deliver successfully. I can just go to my Gmail. Let's say Gmail. I log into my Gmail to see whether it's sent successfully. So my Gmail is coming up. Sorry that I might have a, a slow network here. So, um, still logging in into my email. My network is slow. Still logging in. Uh, what's going on? Thank God. Uh, I have a network challenge. I don't have a network challenge. The network is not that strong. So, I think let's to try it. Okay, I think I have to pause this video for a while to work on my network uh, let me pause the video for a while to work on my network so I pause this video so welcome back to the video so you see now um, my network has connected I was able to connect my network so that's it so you see now that the message delivers you say me because uh, these are the one of the uh, emails that I send that message to so you can see it say me then I can open this email you see it's, it delivers safely so the next thing I'm gonna do is to check other emails that I send this message to uh, I can check other emails that I send it to I can click on this. Uh, I say, okay, these are one of the emails that I send this message to. I can open this to see whether it delivers safely. Yes, it delivers. So it's an opportunity to own a professional website. You understand? So it delivers safely. I can check another email, which is uh, this okay uh, okay this one as well delivers safely it's a new message claim design stack so opportunity to own a professional business website let's check another again okay 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 i can check this one as well okay can check this one as well
Mm, yes, deliver safely as well. Is an opportunity to own a professional business website. So you see that all delivers safely. So that's it. Then, if you want the software, you can call me or WhatsApp me on this number. I'll say if you have it already, you want that configuration, you can follow this video. So thanks for watching. Thank you. See you. Bye.